Whoa, it's your lucky day! You now have unlimited money, and you can buy the most expensive things in the world. Hey, get your checkbook out and let's go shopping! So, what do you think your total would come to? Millions? Billions? Well, keep your receipts, and we'll total it up at the end. First, we need some Morning Joe. The most expensive coffee pot is $279 for a set of five. The reason for that jumbo size price tag? It contains the highest quality pea berry coffee beans and 22 karat gold dust. How about enjoying the most overpriced omelet in the world along with that coffee? It'll cost you $1,000 at the Le Parker Meridian Hotel in New York. The omelet contains caviar and lobster. Ooh, fancy! The most pricey keyboard retails at $4,200. It's coated with gold dust and arushi lacquer, a sap from a tree native to East Asia. The most overpriced feather for sale is $8,400. It comes from a now extinct bird species called the huea. The remaining feathers are sold in auctions, and from what I hear, there are only a few left. The world's most exorbitant pair of jeans goes for $10,000. They're the Escada Couture Swarovski Crystal Jeans, and they're customizable. You can add 14 karat gold rivets and diamond buttons if you want. Now, let's talk about toys. The most high-priced Lego brick you could add to your collection was sold in 2012 for 12,500 bucks. It's made of 14 karat gold, but originally it wasn't for sale. The company gave it as a gift to its long-term employees. If you're looking to book the most pricey haircut, head to London. That's where a woman from Italy paid a UK hairdresser $16,400 for a luxurious appointment. It included lunch, a head massage, personalized hair products, and a limo ride to the airport. Fortune cookies might come free with takeout, but you're a big spender now. Get yourself the world's most affluent one for 17 grand. That's what it went for auction in 2006. Now, to keep a clean house, you can get the most luxurious vacuum cleaner. It's the Hyla GST Swarovski Edition, and it retails at $21,900. That house will cost you a pretty penny too, but that'll be later. The most costly ice dessert is a chocolate ice cream sundae served at the Serendipity 3 restaurant in New York. It contains the most unique cocoa beans and 23 karat edible gold. It comes in a golden dish filled with real diamonds. All that for just 25,000 bucks. The world's most expensive wedding cake you can't eat was sold at a Sotheby's auction for $29,900 back in 1998. It was a piece from the 1937 wedding cake of the Duke and Duchess of Windsor. No wonder you can't eat it, it's probably as hard as a rock. Now, you can finally have your fancy coffee in the world's most costly coffee mug. It was made for Nestle from 23 karat gold. The mug sold for over $33,000 in 2008. You could also get the world's most lavish painting done by elephants. It was sold in 2005 for $39,000 doesn't say here whether you also get a trunk to store it in. You in the market for a water bottle? The most high-priced one you can buy is covered with 24 karat gold, and it's based on the artworks of Mo Digliani. It's worth $60,000. The most costly hair clippings go for $115,000. They belong to Elvis Presley. The lucky buyer got a mass of hair around 3 inches in diameter in 2002. The costliest teddy bear to own is a Steve Louis Vuitton. Your cuddly new friend was last sold for more than $182,000 in 2000. You'll also need a jewelry box for some of the items I'll talk about later. The most exorbitant one ever sold is a Cartier jewelry case made of ancient Egyptian steel, and it went for $189,000 in 93. The priciest perfume to buy is the Clive Christian No. 1 Imperial Majesty. It's a 10-bottle limited-edition fragrance that goes for over $200,000. It's decorated with a 5-carat white diamond and an 18-carat gold collar. 
When it first came out in 2005, that price also included a personal delivery to the buyer in a Bentley. Another high-ticket toy to go along with your teddy bear is the first-ever handcrafted toy soldier from 1963. It was sold in 2003 for $205,000. Yet a mere Barbie doll can go higher than that. The most lavish one you could buy came out in 2010 during the Australian Fashion Week. Price? Over $300,000. The most high-priced single glove for your collection was bought by Ponty 16 Resort in 2009. It belonged to Michael Jackson and was sold for $420,000. Need some wheels? The costliest bicycle sold at auction is the Trek Butterfly Madon, and it belonged to a professional road racing cyclist, Lance Armstrong. The lucky buyer grabbed it for a half a million dollars. Yes, you're a big spender now, so you'll need a newly renovated bathroom to match. The most luxurious bathtub that broke the world record in 2010 is cut from a 20,000-pound Amazonian crystal stone. It's a little more than 6 feet long and filled with diamond cuts that highlight the abstract shape of the crystal. It'll cost you $845,000, but I doubt it can fit in a Bentley like that pricey perfume. Oh, you'll need a pet, too. The costliest dog you could get was sold in China in 2011. It was an 11-month-old red Tibetan Mastiff, and this pooch went for a little over $1.5 million. The most high-priced board game is an exclusive Monopoly set filled with 23-karat gold, rubies, and sapphires. The dice have 42 full-cut diamonds for the spots, and it'll cost you 2 million bucks. The most overpriced phone number you could own had all the same 7 digits. It was sold in 2006 for 2.75 million. Hmm, what digits would you choose? Another lavish item to entertain you is the world's first and most expensive comic book. It goes all the way back to 1938, and it was sold in 2014 for $3.2 million. Ah, who needs Google Maps when you can invest in the most costly atlas in the world? This relic goes all the way back to the 15th century Italy. It was the first illustrated book with engraved maps, and it went for $3.9 million in 2006. Speaking of centuries-old items, here's my fifth-grade teacher. <laughs> nah, no, just kidding. How about a royal carpet made in 1740 for the King of France's dining room? It sold for $4.4 million in 2000. The most costly dress you could get your hands on in an auction belonged to Marilyn Monroe. It was a custom-made gown, and it went for $4.8 million in 2016. For fans of veteran cars, those are ones made before 1905, you'd have to shovel over some serious dough for the oldest Rolls-Royce still around today. The two-seater was made in 1904 and bought by a collector in 2007 for $7.2 million. Now, you need to go overboard with your holiday decor, too. The most extravagantly decorated Christmas tree is valued at 11 million bucks. It broke the record in 2010 when it was on display in the Emirates Palat. The 43-foot tree was covered in 181 gems. The priciest wedding dress you could get your hands on was made for a luxury bridal show, and it's filled with real diamonds that add up to 150 carats. It's worth $12 million. The costliest car registration to put on your veteran Rolls Royce consists of a single digit, one. It was sold in 2008 for the hefty price of $14.2 million. The most expensive musical instrument for your collection was sold at an auction in 2011. It's the Lady Blunt Stradivarius violin that went for almost 16 million bucks. Uh, don't fiddle around with that one. Time to give your wrist some bling. You could go bold and vintage with the most luxurious watch ever sold. It's the Henry Graves Jr., an intricate gold watch that was made around 1925. 
Auction price in 2014? $24 million. The world's most costly phone is a custom-made Falcon Supernova iPhone 6. It's made of 24 karat gold, and it has a huge pink diamond on the back. It goes for $48.5 million if you're interested. Now it's time to fill your safe. The world's most expensive jewel you could purchase is called the Pink Star, and it was sold at an auction in 2017. It was mined in 1999 and originally boasted 132 carats. It took two years to get it cut and polished, which dropped it down to about 60 carats. It still raked in $71.2 million, though. The most high-priced artwork you could buy from a living artist at an auction is called The Rabbit. It's a sculpture that was created in 1986, and it was purchased for $91 million in 2019. Now you need accommodation to put all your stuff in. A mere storage locker? No, no, no! The world's costliest private house was built in 2010. It's a 27-story skyscraper, and it was priced at $2 billion with a B. It has 168 parking spaces, 3 helipads, a few swimming pools, and even a couple of theaters. Which brings our total to just over $2.3 billion. Let me know down in the comments which item you'd buy if you could. And if you learned something new today, then give the video a like and share it with a friend. And here are some other cool videos I think you'll enjoy. Just click to the left or right. And remember, stay on the bright side of life.